Hey everyone, it's Mackenzie, and in this video, we're gonna talk a little bit about what is amyloidosis. So I personally had what's known as AL amyloidosis, or referred to as primary amyloidosis. Um, there are a number of different types of amyloidosis, but I'm gonna talk with you just about AL because that's the one that I'm most familiar with. So primary amyloidosis uh, is a disease that originates in the bone marrow. So the bone marrow is composed of a number of different types of cells, but there's a small subset of the bone marrow that's comprised of what's called plasma cells. So we all have plasma cells, but in people with amyloidosis, we have rogue plasma cells. So some of our plasma cells don't function um, normally as they should, and they produce what's known as the amyloid protein. So the amyloid protein is a misfolded protein and our body is usually very good about discarding proteins that are misfolded, right? We are constantly making different proteins throughout our body and every once in a while we make a bad one. You know, that's normal. Our bodies aren't perfect. And the body is usually very good about breaking down and um, discarding of that protein. But in the case of amyloid, our body isn't able to break down that protein. So that protein is able to you know, survive in the body. And what happens is these proteins kind of clump together. They form what's known as fibrils and they attach to major organs. So they commonly affect organs like the heart, kidneys, liver, GI tract, and nervous system are kind of the, the main ones, but they can affect any organ. And as the disease progresses and we produce more and more of the abnormal protein, you know, the deposits in the organs get bigger and bigger and those functions of the organ slowly deteriorate. And eventually, you know, at the most severe point in the disease, those organs can no longer function and it results in organ failure. So um, the disease is um, very serious and that's one of the reasons why I found in McKenzie's mission is because it's so important to diagnose the disease earlier. Um, we, you know, when those deposits aren't as great and the function of the organ is much higher um, than later stages of the disease. So that's a little snapshot of what amyloidosis is. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something and I'll see you guys in the next video.